He is the alpha male of our species. And Lesnar looking to dominate. The following is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Minneapolis, Minnesota. Weighing in at 295 pounds. The WWE Champion, Brock Lesnar! Brock Lesnar's been a dominant force his entire career. And Brock's double-digit world title reigns should be all the proof you need. You think there's any limit at all to the carnage that's to come here tonight? Oh, Saxton, you know better. We should expect nothing short of total decimation. Of course, Lesnar's never one for holding back. The Beast wins decisively. The Beast wins by ripping guys apart. of Lucha Libre. Santos Escobar, Cruz Del Toro, and Joaquin Wilde. Three men set on dominating WWE. Representing Legado Del Fantasma from Mexico City, Mexico, weighing in at 200 pounds, Santos Escobar. Each man individually is a top level high flyer. Together, they're unstoppable. Especially since they'll do anything to win, even kidnapping. I don't know how you do it, but this guy has got to find a way to stand unafraid if he wants a chance of surviving against the Beast Incarnate. And don't adjust your TV set, folks. That is the new and improved Brock Lesnar. Au contraire, Cole. Don't let the smile and cowboy hat fool you. This is the same Brock Lesnar as always. Suplex City, eat, sleep, conquer. That's all still very much in his blood. That's true, Corey. I suppose he's just letting himself enjoy it more, which really has to rattle his opponents. And facing him is Santos Escobar, one of the more controversial superstars today. Escobar is obsessed with the legacy of Lucha Libre, but wants to create one on his own terms. No mask, all results. Escobar's creating a new, modern tradition, one win at a time. As far as he's concerned, he doesn't need to wear a mask to properly honor his ancestors. Being able to pull that off, no one is going to question if you skip going to the gym today. Perched up top. Lesnar delivering with frightening force. Brock's like a beast playing with its food. Big four. In my opinion, what makes Brock so dangerous is the fact that he knows just how good he is. That really allows him a mental edge that I'm not quite sure of how you overcome when you're in the ring with him. The key, if you can survive long enough, is patience, Cole. Lesnar's been known to play with his food rather than take the easy W. And that, in turn, can leave him somewhat vulnerable. And Escobar didn't see that coming. And there's a takedown. He may be in a bad way here. That's the brutality we've come to expect from Brock. Uh oh, jawbreaker! Call the dentist. Going for it. Trying to step through. All on their belly. Boston Crab is in. This is trying to find a way out. Using his power to escape. Close line. Blistering shoulder block. 
I don't know if this is a good idea. This is going to take more strength than he has left. Lift up. This is a dire situation right now. Now. Yeah, Santos has run into a roadblock. And Escobar isn't looking helpless anymore. Escobar hoping to start a blitz of his own. Lester with a well-timed shot. And this is just outrageous power from German. I think we know what's coming next. Come. Oh. 